Hi guys, it's me Jessica. Um, I'm going to do it in my mailbox. I wanted to update you on some of the other things I received in my mailbox in my um, break from YouTube that I didn't show you in my last video. A lot of you like to see DVDs that I get. Um, so wanted to show you those things. Um, talk about a site that I use for some of my new subscribers that haven't heard me speak about it. Um, he has a, right now it is 1.30 on the Jersey Shore. And it feels like, I don't know if you can see that. 115 degrees Fahrenheit outside. Okay, at least the humidity is only at 45 percent, but feels like 115 degrees. So, anyways, <laughs> I just had to complain. So, the first things that I had received, and this is book related, is Sex in the City. Um, this is the third season. I got this from Swap.com. If you're a new subscriber, you might not know about that site, but you can swap DVDs, including season DVDs, video games books, audiobooks, and CDs. Um, pretty much you put what you have uh, on your list and then you create a want list and swaps are initiated to you. You can accept or reject them. All you do is mail your item out and then that person mails you the item you're swapping for. So you're only paying for the cost of um, shipping which oftentimes isn't really expensive. It's usually less than three dollars. So um, as many of you know this is a series or this was a book written by Candace um, Bushnell and I've watched pretty much every single one of them. I really just wanted to rewatch them. So I think I'm going to be getting into bed and watching that. Um, I was woke up at 4 o'clock and 4.45 in the morning last night and found out that my dog that lives at home with my parents um, passed. So kind of in a blah mood. So definitely it's hot out. There's no reason to be doing anything. So at least I have a reason to kind of curl up in bed and watch one of these DVDs. I also have... Dracula 2000 and Cursed, it's on one DVD, and I also have The Dark Knight, I forgot to grab those two, I haven't watched. I also swapped for Glee, which is, this is the first volume. I've heard so much about this, I'm big into singing, I've always been big into singing, and um, I've always wanted to do something with my music, so I think I'll really enjoy this, um, but I wanted to kind of start from the beginning, so this is the first part, Road to Sectionals. So I swapped for that. I also got Nip Tuck Season 3. Um, I do enjoy this. Um, I watched Season 1 and 2, and um, I just wanted to continue on my journey. It is kind of creepy, um, like as you could see, it's creepy, but um, I do like it sometimes. Um, the last thing I'm really excited about, I purchased this on eBay for $17. I believe it's usually $35 or $40. I got Pretty Little Liars Season 1. I haven't watched any of the TV show, so this is all of it. Um, 963 minutes, so that's what? 15 hours? 16 hours, about 16 hours. So I'm really excited to see how they incorporated Sarah Shepard's series into TV form. And I got two things for my birthday. Um, not sure if I talked about it on this channel, but when I was a kid, I absolutely loved Pee Wee Herman. <laughs> so I got Pee Wee Herman's Playhouse Season 1 and 2. And my mom got this. My dad, my parents got me that part of my birthday present, which was my birthday was June 10th. So I've been watching, I think I watched about 10 episodes, maybe a little bit more. I was watching a lot of it. I might watch some of that today too because it's silly and it'll make me laugh. Okay, so this, by the way, this is like in my bell box 60-something. Um, I don't know the number exactly, but that's crazy. Um, the reason why I did this is to show you the things that I got yesterday in the mail. Um, only two things, but I got Beverly Hills 90210 Season 3. Um, I absolutely love this show. This is probably one of the top shows that I watched as a kid. Um, it was a little grown up for my age, but I always was very mature for my age. And my mom knew that I could handle those situations. Just because I watched Beverly Hills now too, I wasn't promiscuous. I didn't, you know, I wasn't drinking at 12. I wasn't doing stupid shit. So, sorry for the language. Um, but, um, I'm trying to see here. This is, yeah, I was like 7 or 8 when this was out. It says there's 23 hours on here. That's insane. There's 29 episodes. So, there's 8 discs. And I'm really excited. Um, I watched season 1 a while ago and I watched part of season 2. So, this will be 3. And then I continue. Um, there's like a few series. I really enjoy getting these. And um, if I can get them on swap, I'm not paying anything besides something that I watched already. 
and um, I'm shipping out. So it's a great thrifty way to get new things. Um, if you're on a budget or you like to receive things in the mail, but you just don't have the money or whatever, does, swapping is just a really, you know, great um, new trend um, that I've been doing since 2005, I think, and now it's like more popular. Also, big thanks to Dylan. Um, Dylan told me that the fourth bind up of Sweep, Kate Tiernan's uh, Sweep series, which these are, um, uh, let me think, 10, 11, and 12 books. I haven't read the other bind up. Um, came out, and when I found that out, I went on eBay, I ordered it, and two days later, I already had received it. So I paid $8.99, usually at $7.99, but I didn't have to leave my house, I didn't have to drive there. I did, you know, I might not have even got it, I might have had to go to a few places, so I saved time, and I saved gas, and it was thrifty, and it was green, and I got my bind up. So I'm really excited about that. So that's my in my mailbox and an update. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, I will be going out of town to Michigan on Tuesday until the following Wednesday. Um, so I won't be doing any videos. I'm not bringing my laptop with me. Um, I'm just bringing my flash drive with the files I need to do my work. Um, but I'm really, I hate flying. Um, I usually drive there, but because of the cost of gas and, and my back, um, stuff that's been going on with my back, um, I can't be in sitting for that long and it's just not cost effective anymore. So, um, I'm flying. So I try to take the least amount of stuff with me as possible. I'm going to my parents' house, so I don't bring a huge suitcase of clothes. I wash clothes while I'm there. Um, I'm just really practical, practical person. Um, so I'm not bringing my laptop with me, so I won't be able to do videos. But when I come home, um, I'm sure I will have it in my mailbox of whatever had come for me while I was gone, or maybe a few things that I got while I was there. I'm not really going to be able to do a big haul like I usually do when I go home because I'm not going to be able to bring as much stuff home with me. So um, that's in my mailbox. Happy Friday, and I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.